welcome to tonight's upload. My name's Emma, subscribe for hauls and vlogs. And a few weeks ago, I asked on a vlog, which I will link in the description, if you had any questions for me. I think the last time I did this might have been when I hit 5,000 subscribers, and since then, I've gone past seven. Zoella, I'm after you, Bab. She's quaking in her boots. So, let's go and have a little look at the questions. There were some quarkers. I'll try and get through as many as humanly possible. So, we'll start off with Twitter. Don't forget to go and follow me at BrummanMove2. For information about who I fancy I made in Chelsea, that's probably about it. Okay, Rebecca Widnall. Hello, Rebecca. If you could be a Disney princess, who would you be and who would be your Disney husband? Boom, Rapunzel. Flynn. Rapunzel and Flynn. Rapunzel is amazing. I'm going to be controversial, but I, I like Rapunzel when she has a long hair. Um, nothing wrong with short brown hair, but I like the long blonde hair. And I love Flynn, because he's like a bit of a bad boy. I think I might have thought about this too much. I like Flynn. I don't like, um, it's not Hans, is it? Who's the one from Frozen? His name's escaped me. He seems like a drip. So it's got to be Flynn. Rebecca at Meadow Daisy. Hello. Um, I hear you're currently moving house, holiday and switching jobs. Yes. How do you deal with stress in busy times like this? I'll be honest, I cry. Quite, quite a lot. I'm the kind of person that lies awake in the middle of the night with silent tears dripping down my face or the kind of person that screams at my husband. But you know I love stationery, so I also write lists. But I had, this has definitely, without a shadow of a doubt, been the most stressful point of my life in a long time. It's just been, it's been hard work. And then we've got Becca, Angel Like 2010. Do you miss the students you taught? Yes. I don't, and I don't know if you're a student that I taught, but I do. I miss them. I never left my school because of the pupils, because the pupils were just amazing. Like, teenagers, hands down, hilarious. They were exceptional people so I never left because of the kids I left because just for a bit of a change then we're off to Instagram Beth who is Twindorelma who's she's got loads of Instagram followers go and follow her who is your favorite least favorite Disney character which character do you think you're most like and why okay so we're on the Disney thing again my favorite character Flynn <laughs> I think we've discussed that I do I fancy a cartoon character do I need to get out more I, I think probably yes my least favourite character, what fit? I don't know. There's got to be some films that I sit down and go, oh my God, that's absolutely cack. I can't think off my top of my head. And I think I most like Rapunzel, obviously because of the blonde hair, long and luxurious, because uh, she seems a bit, a bit feisty and a bit batty. So yeah, or maybe Anna. I like Anna as well, because Anna seems a bit, bit, bit of a, a dizzy one, doesn't she? I like Anna. Um, <clears throat> Angel Louise X. What are my top three makeup items at the moment? I always love the Too Faced Better Than Sex um, mascara. Another screenshot for you there. I'm enjoying the Too Faced blusher at the moment. Um, you know, the heart one. And also, I've gone back to a naked palette, which has got like a bronzer and a brush, and I really like the highlighter in that. But when I go to America, I plan to go to Sephora, and I plan to hit it hard. So if any of you have got Sephora recommendations, leave them below. Whilst this is uploaded, I'll be in America, but I'm still gonna be like replying to comments. So any Sephora recommendations, let me know, because I reckon I'm gonna walk in there and just be like baffled. Another one from Instagram, Abby Weavers. What park am I most excited about? I am most excited about visiting the Magic Kingdom, because I just want to walk down and see the castle and then hysterically cry. That's the plan. So it's walk, 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 castle, cry. Instagram, in that order. That's exactly what's going to happen. I'm going to have a single lesson so you won't be able to see the tears. Last one from Instagram, twinkle, twinkle, four. How do my children feel about moving house? Do you know what? They're not really that bothered because we're not moving that far. Um, it's an area that I know really well. So... I'm far more emotional than they are. I'm far more, I'm leaving a house that I left when I went to get married, that I bought babies home to, where I've seen my babies grow up. So I'm, I am by far the most emotional out of, out of everybody. So they don't care. Because they're still only little, aren't they, I suppose. Right, on to the questions in your chore. From Sarah Dean, will the hubby be participating in any vlogs? If you're new to the channel, Love my husband, but the man is a miserable sod. When it comes to YouTube, 
he is not in you he won't even speak so if you do ever see him so i think i made him being was it a birthday one or a father's day? if it's like a big occasion i say to him look you want to be in this because when you look back you're going to want to remember what it was like being at your daughter's sixth birthday party so you'll see him in ones like that but he's never going to sit down and do a challenge with me i mean hell would freeze over if that happened and it's a shame because he's actually really funny and this person said he was a bit dishy and i told him and he was like oh <laughs> he's like oh my gosh he was very excited by that prospect um oh again on with the husband oh hang on there's Katie McQueen and Rebecca Widnall so we've got a, a, she wants to know who play me and the husband and Rebecca wants to know who play Ethan and Erin so similar sort of questions I think I would probably be played by myself because I'm such a great actress who would I be played by I like Drew Barrymore I like Drew Barrymore. I think she's great and she seems a bit crackers. My husband would be played by, um, who would my husband be played by? I'm gonna say, back in the day, back in Love Actually day, Colin Firth, cause he's like tall and quite quiet. Um, not, not Colin Firth now, Colin Firth back in the day. And my kids, who would play my kids? I don't really know, that's hilarious. Well, Erin would wanna play herself, she'd be like, I'm not letting anybody else take over my position. And I don't know, Ethan would be played by some absolute lunatic child to get across all of his mania. Um, hilarious. How did you choose the names of your children and would you want any more children? That's from Nee McGreal. Hello. I chose the name of my children because my name is Emma and I am a little bit like Chris Kardashian, like the momager. I'm like, I need all my children to be named after me. And because we've got an Irish heritage, Erin was quite a, a, a nice name, um, so we went down that, and then we went to Ethan. Other names we considered were, were Elijah. Um, if Erin was going to be a boy, it was going to be Finn. But then all my parents, my parents were like, "No, that sounds like a fish." It was like you know, in the time of Glee. Oh, R.I.P. Finn. Oh, such a shame. And for the last question, so we don't end up on like a real sad note about a dead cast person from Glee. Um, from Karen Taplin. Hello. Is there one item of clothing other than Maud that I would like to wear for the rest of my life? So we've got Maud and Jeff in my dressing gowns. It has to be a legging. Call me old fashioned, call me a tramp. I don't care. Leggings, but like leggings that come up to here. So like, literally, if you can see me now, my tights are just underneath my bra. So things that come up really high. Or I also really enjoy a flowery dress. I love a flowery frock. You can't beat a flowery frock. I like to think I look like Holly Willy Booby in it, and I'm like, I'm a yummy mummy. But I'm not, I'm just like a woman in a flowery dress that probably just looks super frumpy. Right, thank you if you've asked questions. Sorry if I didn't get to them. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you have, and a high five if you want to subscribe. Please do leave below in the comments any other videos you'd like me to do. I love doing station hauls. And um, when we go to our new house, there's going to be home hauls, you know decorating things there'll be loads of homey stuff so that'll be really exciting and house tours i think somebody asked a question about that there will definitely be house tour videos um let me know what you want don't do food stuff because i can't cook so don't even think about it bye guys